I've recorded six videos like I did before, and I promise that next weekend for me, I'm going to record probably three videos, because I've recorded so much, and, ha and have fallen behind on so many uploads. So I might be recording three videos. Welcome back for some more Paper Mario the Origami King. I'm Omega Dragon. Last time, we went to Crescent Moon Island, so, so called, that turned into Full Moon Island, and went fishing and got two giant fish, and finally got the Fish Finder Trophy. And, I, and then we got a letter from Luigi saying that he was on Mushroom Island and found Diamond Key, which, which he thought was a key to Princess Peach's castle. Sadly, he was wrong. And then we went here in the origami craftsman's room and figured out the true identity of King Ollie. And la and the end of the last part, I thought that the uh, that the supplies used for folding origami was spoilers, but it didn't spoil anything because everyone has already seen the four bosses from different scenes of the game. You've already seen the stapler in the prologue. You've already seen the colored pencils as the first boss. The second boss was the hole punch, and the third boss was oh dang it, what was it? The hole. The hole punch was the second boss, I thought. No, third boss. The second boss was the rubber bands. Darn it. That's why I couldn't think of anything. I was gonna say the third boss was rubber bands, but then I remembered that it was switched. Second boss was rubber bands, and the third boss was the hole punch. But oh, now the origami craftsman has stopped us. Wait. Take these notes with you, Olivia. I'm sure they can help you. Is this... Oh my gosh. Thank you. Ooh, that's so neat. Okay, Mario. Let's get going. What did Olivia carry? You'll soon see. Soon meaning near the end of the game. And it's amazing. And I will surely turn off my commentary for it. So, now, we are going island hopping again, so of course it is added in, and I'm going to speed up every time we go to an island. Let's collect some treasures and go island hopping. And if you don't want to explore every island, just go to the center of the three islands, if you have explored two of the three islands, and the, and the treasure will be there. Again. There's the ferry right now. So just go slightly here and then press down here. I think. Yes. Gotta reset the view. Switching controls are pretty annoying. Times. What the heck did I just see? This is another collectible treasure, of course. Collectible treasure number 85, Training Mannequin. down here I think there's something down here yep
No, dang it. I'm trying to reset the positions. Collectible treasure number nothing. It's a, it's a thousand coins. And you can now see something up there. This is the this is what what was supposed to be the final island to go to. Nothing, all right. Nothing, all right, so this is where you need to go. What the, the tower is massive. What kind of island is this? The tower standing in the great sea. That's the sea tower, obviously. So that's where we need to go. But well, we can't get there yet. I can't believe we actually got there. Purple streamer wraps all the way to the top. This one might be a bit trickier. But we can't get there because we need three orbs. What the heck? Oh, fly guys! Wait a minute. I've not fought these guys ever. I've never fought these guys. I didn't even think they existed. So this is new on me. These are actually called Fly Guys. That surprises me. So I think they have more health, but these are called Fly Guys. I said that so many times already. They're sort of like par. You can call them par guys if you want, but the, that makes a lot. That doesn't make sense. Or you can just call them normal shy guys. What you need to do, you don't have to worry about jumping on them with the normal boots, but I'm still going to use iron boots anyways. I think how much health they have is like 30. That hammer will never reach. I'm going to see how much health they have. Oh wow. Maybe they have the same health as the Jag guys do. Now I'm going to use... I'm going to cook them. I think they have 30 health though, but I'm not sure. That's why I'm testing. Yep, they certainly do. Blump. Oh my goodness, so that block damage was terrible. It only blocked like two damage off. That's why they get that's why they get the guard the guard plus badges. If you want them to do half the damage towards you, you need that guard plus badge. I did not know that. So I'm going to use a shiny hammer. Yes, I am. Eh. Mm. Is it working? Is it gonna work? Yes. Oh, I forgot this was a wave battle. Three moves, right? Yes. I already know what to do here. So now I'm going to use use the normal moves against everyone here. Because I think the fly guys just have the same health as the sad guys do. That's cool. I did not think they existed in this game. Seeing new things every day. Because the first time I played through this, I just went straight into the tower because I already got everything I needed. I didn't even know about the fly guys because I never bothered to check the enemy territory. So now, I already fought the fly guys, but now this Jai, now I'm going to talk to this Jai guy right here. I've heard there are 11 islands out there and on the ocean, I just don't know where they are. 11 islands, he says. And I got 10 coins. So, so far I have visited 
One, two, I'm not counting the cruiser because that actually doesn't count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven islands out of eleven. Wait, that can't be no I'm doing it. Yeah, that I already counted the battle island. Somehow I thought I didn't. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did I count the question mark island? No, I didn't, so eight. The Diamond Island also counts as an island, despite what you would think. Spade Island. This one is unmistakably shaped, uh, spade shaped. We we'll call it Spade Island. I love how the cruiser moves. I did not think it would ever move, but of course I never repaired every hole. To see for myself. And you're going to see that the toad is stuck. What you need to do here is rescue every toad. And there's also a Goomba sleeping here. Ha! Rude awakening. You don't deserve any breaks. Ha! There's one. Whoa, this looks bad. Hang on, I'm coming. Hang on, friend, I'm coming. You talk to this one right here. We'll save you. Hey, I'm in the real pickle here. My friends should be able to help if you can find them on this island. Oops. Ah! Ooh, my brother's playing Pixelmon. Toad! Whoa, this looks bad. Hang on, friend, I'm coming! Toad. Whoa, this looks bad. Hang on, friend, I'm coming. One more toad, the blue toad. Oh, there he is. Now you need to push them all in their slots. Oh, not by hammering them. Ah! Ah! Got him. <laughs> there he is. Thanks for saving all of us, and especially me. I don't have a reward for you, but I can show you where a cool spot to fish for treasure out here. <laughs> Why? My vest is gone! No! The world can see my shame! <laughs> They'll move together. We won't let our friends be humiliated. Dignity ha huddle. I know. Activated. Phew. I suppose the one thing any toad really needs is good friends. And the backup vest for emergencies. So I've rescued every toad, got every question mark block, and have recovered every non bottomless hole. And now I gotta uh, check this one. So, now, I'm going to just look for some more islands, because I have not found any other islands <laughs> other than those Why islands. So, so now I'm going to look for more islands. Because I don't know any other oh, island out here. Sorry. Golden Starfest! I gotta go to it! <laughs> 
go. Darn it. Where am I? This way. Come on, where am I now? Oh, this one. Alright. I never would have guessed. Incineroar? Hey. I don't get why my Incineroar is so tight. I love Incineroar, dang it. I wanna see this. <gasps> uh. And I. If I find something else, I want it. Oh, one thing I want is. Ooh, I'm kind of tempted to. I wanna take my Pokemon. Send the gun! Fucking get my Island Barrow. My brother wants to send the gun that he wants my favorite Pokemon in, in Galar. <laughs> I'm looking for another island though. I've never seen any other island before, so whatever island I do encounter, I'm going to that exact island. First off, I'm going here, on the top right corner. Well, you know what, I'm gonna cut this for now. Oh, I would've encountered a no cross zone. Darn it, nothing. There's 10 coins. That's not what I want. Alright, so, I'll see you guys in a moment. I'm back. Sorry. I'm sucking on an enzyme. Ooh, I see waves and they're heading straight towards me. I'm gonna go down. Damn. Nothing <laughs> I'm expecting. And I would go to the Diamond Island, but I'm trying to look for other islands. I guess I've never seen other islands before. Ha! Run you over like bowling pins. Now I'm going downwards to see if I can find another island. It's so tight. Oh, I've never seen this island before. A hammer. Floating alone among the waves, I'll call it Hammer Island. I've never seen this island before, so this is one of the new islands I'll ever explore. So what will this island be? It will surprise me if I encountered spiked enemies and also just awesome ones. Are you serious? It's just a collectible treasure right out there, but I think there's going to be sidesteppers as well. It's an Aron, not an Aron. <laughs> this is it? A legendary hammer. You get... I get this now? I did not think you do. So it comes from a chest. I thought I would get this in chapter 5. The final long chapter of the game. Well... I guess not final chapter of the game, but I thought it would. But never mind. It's the it's a long adventure chapter, but whatever. I'm not gonna say. I should so forget it. The strongest and fanciest hammer in the game, lies. This shiny hurl hammer is the strongest hammer in the game. Go figure. Oh my. I knew it was an ambush. Okay, so where do I even go? I got ambushed. Oh. I fight them. 
That's cool. Shiny ice flower. Yeah, the the fire bros are weak to ice, so. Collectible treasure number 78. Hammer. Event battle. Different plants. So I'll use the fire flower and the ice flower. Oh, now I, now I know why they said shiny. So never mind, I'll use the shiny ice flower twice. I want ice cream. <laughs> now I want ice cream. Go figure, the nipper plants are also weak to ice. So they're weak to both fire and ice. And nipper plants are baby piranha plants. So that's one, but now I have to deal with the others. I know. No chest here. Another shiny ice flower. <laughs> Poor Diglett. Is there a toad in one of these barrels? Yeah. Can't do anything about it. Huh. I'm gonna check the map. There are, <laughs> there are toads, but there are no non bottomless holes. Oh, yeah, I saw this earlier. I was wondering what that was. Knew it. Shiny fire flower. There's four question mark blocks in this uh, yeah. island. I'm gonna try to get every question mark block. So how do I get up here? I don't see any way. I'm gonna use my hidden block. That's how are we supposed to get back, yada yada. I was going to press Y and use a hidden block on hider. Yeah. It will show me it will show me. Huh. So the hidden block is right there. I can't get to it. Oh, hi. I'm going to just battle these guys. This is what I'm going to do. Never mind. No, I just did it. Darn it, that means I should have had my ice hammer with me as well. Oh good. My shiny hammer broke. I use my flashing hurl hammer, even though these nipper plants have twenty health points. Or twenty two health points, but whatever. So there's supposed to be a toad in trouble. But how am I supposed to get through that hidden item block? <laughs> That's one. Collectible treasure number 79. Captain T. Ode. Yeah. Got every collectible treasure. But 
hole. A toad. Gah, phew, I'm saved. Here, let me show you where you can fish for some treasure as things. Not lapper. Or... I got I got a flashy mushroom. A dazzling mushroom that restores a huge amount of health. Not going to use it. There it is. But there's another one right here that I cannot get. Oh, never mind. Wait, so that. So the hidden block was right there, not on the barrel. But there's a, one more hidden block somewhere. Got it. Got every question mark block. This one's so useful. Yeah, and the boot card was all I cannot use. The whistle was went unanswered. <laughs> Seek ye a path to paradise. Wait, did I rescue every toad? Yes, I did. There was only one toad. So now I'm going island hopping once again. And then, I'm going to cut the video here and say next time we're going to explore Diamond Island. I'm betting the... And I'm betting I know what the next island is. Man, this is impossible. I hate, I hate how there's one mo one more island to find, and yet it's the hardest island to find because, of course, why wouldn't it? <laughs> Where the fish are going down. Ten coins. Oh, I got a hundred coins. I don't want to. I don't want to collect it as a reward. I'm sorry, Golden Swordfish. Apologizing for it. Ooh, wait a minute. That group of that school, those groups of school fish or whatever you would call them, just the schools. Man, I would have never known that. Got it. A thousand coins. I'll just say I'll just say that group of fish 
really surprised me. Well, this is where the collectible treasure is. Oh. Darn it, there's nothing there. <laughs> it's so cute. Collectible treasure. Is this even collectible treasure or is it coins? It might not. Oh, yeah, it's just treasure because that's where the toad led us. It is collectible treasure number 88. King Shroomsis' cabin. Coffin. I said cabin. I almost said cabin. It's a coffin. What the heck? It can't be. where the chest was in every other location, but I guess not here. Now I'm going now I'm coming back to finding the island that I cannot find. And the Goomba said that there were eleven islands. And so far I've found one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh my, wait. Twelve how many islands were there? I I did say eleven islands. Did I actually explore every island? I thought I I thought there were twelve islands actually. I have to find that guy again. There are eleven islands, and I was looking for the for the island for a long, long time, and the only island left is the diamond island. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and the other island is underneath this place. Called it the Diamond Island. I just have to look at my map every so often. I don't think I've gotten every collectible treasure in the Great Sea because they haven't given me the every collectible treasure has been found sign. And indeed, I did not collect every collectible treasure, and I think there's four left or two left. I'm just looking at the treasure every so often. Now, this is where it is. What is this? It's huge! I've seen things he wouldn't believe, but a huge diamond on, on the seafloor? That's new to me. Ah, an opening. Diamond key. Don't mind the background noise. I'm not trying to ruin the scene, and I don't want to. I don't want to close my commentary either. Look how beautiful this island is. Oh my gosh. This this is what the inside of a diamond looks like. There are trees and mountains and temples. It's like an island. Of course. Hmm, a hidden jewel. Lost to time, slumbering beneath 
the waves. It seems so familiar. I would swear I've heard a legend about this place. I won't try to force a name upon it. So if it's, suffice to say, this island is as rare as a diamond. It's called Diamond Island. Welcome, travelers. You have done well in acquiring the diamond key, but your trials are just beginning. Here you shall undergo the three trials of power, wisdom, and courage. For each trial you, that you complete, you will be awarded an orb. You may enter the temples in any order you choose. Now, go forth and earn your orbs. Good luck. Orb? What's an orb? Is that like a prize or something? Well, I do like to win things, so let's give it a try. Did you talk to this one again? Conquer the three trials of power, wisdom, and courage to attain the sacred orbs. Oh, this thing again. Whoa! Wow! What kind of crazy magic circle is this? I feel all sorts of power welling up inside me. I might be able to use any of our elemental powers. But I'm not going to go to that because we need another elemental. Next time in Paper Mario and the Origami King, we are going to the Ice Elemental Temple. 